Hey, what's up, guys? COE33 here with my sister, Lee, and we're here with another episode of... We, we Got, got mail. mail! And we got some really cool packages in the mail. We have two of them to share with you, and uh, one of them is this month's Indie Box. Cool! So, and then another one is a trade package that we did with Metro J, so that's kind of fun, huh? Mm -hmm. So, should we start with the Indie Box? Yeah, let's start with the Indie Box. All right. So, this arrived a few days ago. And uh, the game this month is called Freedom Planet. Ooh. And it kind of reminded me of like Sonic the Hedgehog. Cool. So I'm definitely eager to see what's inside this package. Ooh. So the last indie box that we got for Axiom Verge was really cool. They had that uh, bookend in it and all kinds of neat goodies. All right. Let's see. Wow. So. Grab that and show the people on YouTube. Ooh! All right, show the camera there. There's our game. Yeah, Freedom Planet. So there's the box. Very cool. I watched a little gameplay footage on uh, online, and it definitely reminded me of, like an old school 16-bit uh, like Sonic the Hedgehog style game. So should we open it up? Yeah. All right, let's do that. Hope everyone's having a good holiday season. We're definitely enjoying it. You can see we got the game room decked out and got our elf hats on. Yeah, we got our elf and magic going. Yeah. All right. Plastic off. And let's see what's inside. Yeah, let's... All right. Do the unveiling. Oh, this. So it looks like we got a Freedom Planet Kingdom Stone pouch. It kind of looks That's like... nice, huh? A little it, leather material. It kind of looks like one of those... Um, magic bags. Magic coat pouch? You want to see what's inside of there? Yeah. There's something in there. I do. And then we got the game, which is on a USB flash drive. It's DR DRM free, which is really cool. Ooh, I think. Ooh, I think I was right. Hold on, right. Why don't you show them? Oh, wow. It's like a little marble crystal orb. Or a little magic ball. Cool. <laughs> kind of cool. Yeah. Funny. Put the little magic ball in there, back in there. Okay. And then we have the instruction manual. Ooh. And on the and on the instruction manual, there's all these all the different characters. Yep. Yeah. And then we got the indie box little insert there, their newsletter. And then what do we have here? Ah, the official game soundtrack. Very cool. Wow. I do like it when they include these soundtracks. I, I've been listening to that Axiom Verge soundtrack quite a bit, actually. It's really good. The game is excellent, too. I've been playing it. That and Fallout 4 have been the games I've been playing oh. uh, lately. And then, oh, this might be something you're interested in. This looks like a uh, wallet. So a Freedom Planet wallet. Oh, yeah. That's kind of cool, huh? Yeah. Cool. I like... And then a Freedom Planet sticker. I think this is a wallet with all the uh -huh. different characters on it. You can have that if you want. Yeah. I'd love to have this. And then we got a uh, Mare Zao or Zao Freedom Planet token. Cool. I haven't oh, played the game, so I'm not sure how to pronounce cool. that. And then another little Indie Box sticker. And like last time, they have one of the characters from the game on Sweet. Indie Box sticker. Very cool. Yeah. Nice. Not too shabby. Yeah. Not quite as awesome as that Axiom Verge bust, but still pretty no. cool. But I do like the magic pouch, and uh, definitely look nice on the shelf, and the game looks like a lot of fun, and uh, it'll be interesting to listen to that CD. And we'll put a link to uh, IndieBox in the description below if you want to check it out. All right, should we move on to the package from Retro J? Yeah, let's. All right, thank you, Jay, for sending this to us. We did a trade with Retro J, and we sent him a package, and he sent us something for our Wii collection that we've been wanting uh, for a while. This is a pretty awesome addition to the Wii collection. We're definitely getting a lot of those 
more collectible games checked off the list. So very appreciative that you would send us. I wonder this. what he sent well, us. Well, I told you, so you already know. <laughs> no, I mean, I wonder. Yeah. All right. So, oh, it looks like we got a note here. It says the Game Hunters. That's Ooh. us. <laughs> oh, nice handwriting. Game Very Hunters. Nice handwriting. I'm happy we made a deal and I was able to help you out with your Wii collection. I may have a few games in my extras that you asked for. I will let you know. Anyways, guys, take care. Thanks, Josh Retro J. Very cool. Thank you, Retro J. Really appreciate that. That's awesome. And then here's the game that we traded for, packaged well, which is great considering this is a pretty collectible game. And there it is, Metroid Prime Trilogy. Why don't you show the camera there? Wow. So that's the Steelbook one with the insert. Sweet. Let me get it up close there so that people can see it. So it's got the the cover, the slip cover. And then the steel book, and it's complete. So very cool, awesome addition to our Wii collection. Yeah, really appreciate it. Stoked to have that, and uh, that's pretty awesome. So thank you so much. Uh, if you guys haven't checked out Retro J's channel, definitely go and do that. He has a great collection, a really good channel. Um, so yeah, that's uh, we got mail. What do you think? Yeah, that was a very nice. Pretty awesome, huh? Yeah. All right. Thanks everyone for watching, and until next time, bye.